And there everybody, welcome back to Cool Science, and today I'm going to be showing you another acid-base reaction. This time with, um, the normal method that most kids know, and that's the vinegar and baking soda method. Now, as you can see, I got my baking soda right here, my sodium bicarbonate, and my vinegar in here. Um, I also have some matches to do a flame test, a striker those matches and I found this somewhere I'm gonna put a small amount of vinegar in there that way I can show you the initial reaction before I do the flame test alright so let's get started well I'm gonna use my plastic pipette right here and I'm gonna draw out some uh, um, acetic acid vinegar and I will moderately fill this up in a corner right here so it doesn't disperse alright and now I'll grab a small amount of my baking soda it's large and okay and watch the reaction and it foams alright now time to explain this reaction well the acetic, reacid, the acetic acid reacts with the sodium bicarbonate to create sodium acetate, water, and uh, carbon dioxide. Now, that's what we're going to be doing the flame test for. Now, if it truly is carbon dioxide that is formed, um, the flame should go out. In a previous video I made, it, I did a reaction which produced oxygen, um, and as in that video you saw, the flame got brighter. Um, in this video, it will do the exact opposite because the carbon dioxide will um, overwhelm the oxygen in the air and extinguish the flame. That's what's in fire extinguishers and all that stuff that's used to put out fires. Alright, so let's get started. Now, I'm not sure if I'll be able, if I need more baking soda or not. Uh, I really should have measured this out before, but, oh well. Alright, I'll just, I only have one chance to do this, so, no big deal, it's just, okay. So, I think I'll light my match first. Crap. Pour that in. Do my cover thing. And the flame's getting closer to my hand. And it puts it out. Okay, so we confirm that. So, as you can see, the excess carbon dioxide burned out the... Well, it snuffed out the flame. And now I got all this sodium bicarbonate all over here. That's really, that really sucks. Um, yeah. So, I might be able to get one more reaction for you guys. Oh, I got some more over here. I'll just get rid of that. Just get another small amount. Alright. I have two matches, so not a big problem. Oh god, that's a lot of gas coming out. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but it's literally leaking out of my hand. Now, put it out instantly. Well, I thought you guys would find that pretty cool. That's actually something you can try at your house without having to worry about blowing up your house and all that stuff. Now, the glass feels a little cold. I'm not sure if it's exothermic or endothermic. Exo meaning that it gives off heat, and endo meaning it takes heat in, which pretty much means it will be cold to the touch if it's endo, and it will be hot if it's exothermic. Alright, so thanks for watching, everybody, 
Um, I hope you really enjoyed the videos. Um, please subscribe, write, and comment.